Hello everyone, let's learn how we can extract the fiscal quarter from a fiscal year. Before we understand, before you are going to put the function or formula, let us understand what is fiscal quarter or fiscal year. Most of the organization or company around the world, they believe January is the first month of a year. But at the same time, many organizations are still there. For them, October or April is the first month of a specific year. In that case, it is, it is too complex to find out a fiscal quarter. But I am going to explain in an easy way so that you can have a better understanding how you can uh, find a fiscal quarter. So let's work it out. So here generally we are going to use two function over here. That is choose functions. Let me show you the example how choose function work over here. So index number. Take an example over here. I am giving a number that is 2 comma. At the same time, value 1, 2, 3. 2 is the number, right? Index number. So if I am writing 9, comma, 8, comma, 7. So just because 2 is given in the choose, it will select 8. Because if you see after 2, 9 is first, 8 is second and the 7 one is third. It will extract 8 for you. Have a look over here. So it has been extracted 8 for you. In the same way, you can use the choose formula. But in the text, take an example, same over here. I want to index number is 2, but you want to give a text over here. Take an example, you are giving x. After that, y. After that, c. So what will it, it will extract? Definitely it will extract y over here. Have a look over here. Just because you are giving a number of 2. So we are going to use choose formula along with the month formula to find it out. The fiscal quarter which is starting from April. So let's have a look how you, what, how you are going to write a formula over here. Equal to choose. Then we are going to give a month. From, we want the Excel should extract the month number from here, right, in that way. Then you need to give a comma. Then you write down 4 three times. 4, comma, 4, comma, 4. Then you need to write down, give a comma, 1, 1, 1, 1. Again, it, is, it should be a uh, three time not four times sorry you need to write down three times each of the things like that two two and two then three three comma three close the bracket so if you see all this number over here it is 12 this all the number represent each and every month have a look four times three sorry three times four three times one 3 times 2, 3 times 3. So if you calculate all these things, it is 12. Because one year is having 12 months. The moment you hit enter over here, it has been extracted 3. Have a look over here. Just because we have calculated April as a first quarter of a specific things. Just because nothing is there in April. So let us change this one. Let's make this one as 4, hit enter, automatically it says 1 because already it has been showing from the April. It means April, May, June will be the first quarter of this fiscal year, right? In that way it will work. So you are getting a homework over here. So in this illustration I have explained how you can start the month from April in a fiscal quarter. But at the same time I wanted to give a job. If you want to calculate by keeping October, remember the October as a fiscal start year. So what formula you are going to do it? All the secret, the hint is all the secret lies in this sequence. You need to change the sequence so that you can utilize October also as a fiscal quarter. Thank you very much. Please like and subscribe for more videos like this.